Hello guys, I am back from like a month of not doing videos. <laughs> I'm so sorry about that. It's just David C has not come out with any new teas for the past month or so. And all the teas that I had been recently reviewing um, were teas that had kind of just been released by the public of David's teas. So I guess there were secret teas for a while. That's when I reviewed them. And then they just kind of got released and there hasn't really been anything like new or exciting. They did bring back Southern Lemon on the site, on the Canadian site, and they brought back Berries and Cream Matcha, if you guys were wondering. Um, I have so much of that matcha, so I am well stocked up. And I was like, you know what? I haven't done a video in a month. <laughs> and I'm like, I still have some old teas to review that I have a bag of. I have a whole bag of teas, and I just thought that I would review them a little bit differently. Um, just because I feel like I never, I haven't really read descriptions or ingredients of teas in a long, long time. Just because when I usually do my reviews downstairs, it takes a while to kind of set up, get a laptop, read it off. Whereas if I'm in my room, my laptop's already here. It's all ready and everything. Also, happy Canada Day for any of you Canadians out there. So today we are going to be reviewing Turmeric Glow. Also, do not judge me. This screen is absolutely disgusting, but it does have a protector. I just have not changed the protector. It's just, this is a very, I really have to like clean this off or something. It's really, really bad, but it is protected. The actual screen's protected, so don't worry. I just really gotta kind of do a little clean. So today we're going to be doing turmeric glow. I have not seen this tea come back in three years, maybe two, three years. It is currently not available, but um, this is what it looks like, if you guys are wondering. It is a herbal tea, and it says, Get your glow back with a caffeine-free infusion bursting with ginger, carrots, and turmeric. The golden spice that's been hailed as a, uh, I'm going to butcher this, a Ayurvedic skin saver for centuries. Sweet, warming, and deliciously vibrant. This is one sunny tonic that will have you glowing from the inside out. Drink up and get ready for a bright and shiny new you. Ingredients in this one are pretty small. Carrots, ginger, turmeric, pineapple, beetroot, sweet blackberry leaf, and natural flavoring. So this one, um, me personally, I'm not a big fan of turmeric teas. They are good for you, but I just, they've never really appealed to me unless I'm sick. Um, also, turmeric does stain. So if you guys have this tea or plan on buying this from someone that does have it, Please be mindful of what you're putting it in. If you don't want your stuff to stain, put it in like a crappy glass or like a beat up tumbler or something because you don't want your nice teaware to get stained by this bad boy because it will stain it like no tomorrow. So I believe I have had this tea before. Um, I have it here in my O Canada tumbler. Also, happy Canada's day. I think I already said that, but I'm going to give it a try. I did sweeten this one with a bit of honey. So it's this one's a very juicy tea. It's very fresh. The thing I like about turmeric glow, it's not a burst in your face, heat turmeric. It's a very underlying kind of nice light. You get the turmeric and then you get the ginger. So I feel like the pineapple is pretty dominant in this kind of to contrast from the ginger and the turmeric, making this tea not super like bitter, not super like hot from the ginger because I feel like with turmeric teas it can go really good or really bad and since this one does have ginger it does have a tiny 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 bit of a heat nothing too severe though I could drink this this one is probably the best turmeric tea out there if you guys don't want that strong heat from the turmeric and ginger it's not very sweet even with the honey it doesn't really come out as being sweet uh it's currently unavailable, so I can't tell you the price, but I believe this one was like $8.98 or $9.98 for 50 grams when it came out. A little bit more on the more expensive side just because it does have turmeric, and I guess turmeric is more of an expensive ingredient. Um, but yeah, this one's okay. It's very like, it's not popping in your face flavor. It's very kind of just subtle, light turmeric, which is fine by me. So uh, would I repurchase this tea? I would not. I'm not a fan of turmeric, but... If I had to drink this, I would. If I'm, I don't know if that makes sense, but you know what I mean. Um, would I stock up on this tea? I would not. Rating out of 10, 
it gets points for not having the super heat and it also gets points for being um, kind of mild rather than bursting in your face ginger. So it's like a six out of 10. I'm not really a fan of ginger or turmeric. So that's just my review on turmeric glow by David's tea. It's a bit of an old tea, but I'm going to get back into doing the older reviews. I have a whole bunch. I think I have four. I have vanilla swirl coming. I have dark chocolate delight going to review. I have gingerbread cookie. I have a whole bunch of old teas that I still got to get through. So I hope you guys enjoyed this review and thank you guys so much for watching.